One more innovation in Turkey by Malatya Metropolitan Municipality. Malatya Metropolitan Municipality, which continues to make investments in the concept of environmental-based municipalism, takes the justified pride of applying a Malatya integrated environmental project, which is unique nationally and internationally. Malatya Metropolitan Municipality is planning to supply the illumination needs of 60,000 houses by increasing energy production levels and decreasing waste amounts with four different processes. We are constructing mobile transferring stations which has 10 to 40 tons capacity of qualified solid fuel per hour on 5,000 square meters of land. Nearly 450 tons of waste in central districts are going to be carried via dust carts daily and 100 tons of waste in pilot districts are going to be done via trailers with high capacity of transporting wastes to the decomposing units. Waste which is brought to the decomposing unit is going to be decomposed in four categories. Fuel from waste, purified organic waste, recycle, semi-organic, and other waste. After fuel from waste is dried with the technology which uses lay-by heat, balled and sent to gasification facility via bands, 4 MW of electricity is going to be generated. Purified organic waste is going to put on fermentation by covering it with membrane after it is transferred to biogas reactor lots via bands. MW of electricity is going to be generated following the fermentation process. The other residual waste is going to be used for compost. Sweet tomato is going to be produced from the greenhouse, which is going to be constructed in order to produce without soil. For the greenhouse, lay by heat from the facilities which produce energy is going to be used. Semi-organic and other waste, which is going to be filled in trailers via bunkers, is going to be transferred to the new solid waste storage facility and stored there. 3MW of electricity is going to be generated with methane gas via LFG system of the energy facility. Totally 12.2 MW of electricity is going to be generated with Malatia Integrated Environmental Project and we are planning to brighten 60,000 houses. Cleaner Malatia, clean environment. Malatia Metropolitan Municipality. The Pearl of Marmara, industrial capital city of Turkey. The city 
that produces for 24 hours develops from every aspect and grows. As Kojeli grows, Turkey grows too. As Turkey strengthens, welfare level of our people increases. New houses, new productions, new lives bring new wealth with them. We produce less compared as we did, also we consume much more. How could we treat our West as individual city and the country? How do you dispose of West without damaging to the health of our environment and human? Zaydash, which has carried our new projects into life and the solutions to the issue of West management since 2004, become the leader company not only of Kojeli but also Turkey. It's undergone an important change and gained great success. Zaydash, which is led by Mr. Ibrahim Karasmanoğlu, the mayor of Kojeli Metropolitan Municipality, has made a development and large its range of services along with its capacity. The field of activities of the firm and services it has provided since 1996 are as follows. Zaydash has two different field of activities including throughout Turkey and Koji. The establishment offers hazardous waste disposal service all around Turkey. The plan that has a capacity of incineration of 5,400 kg per age, disposed by incinerating burnable plastic waste caused by industry, used oils, medical and cosmetic waste, petrochemistry waste, PVC solvents, dye waste, adhesive and bonded and similar hazardous waste in frame of the relevant regulations under the continual control of the Ministry for Environment and Urban Planning and generate electricity energy. Its operational incineration capacity per year is on average over 30,000 tons and generated electricity is more than 20 million kilowatt age. Also, strobe hazardous waste caused by industry are disposed in hazardous less landfill area. The services of Izaidash for only Kojeli are as follows. One thousand six hundred tons of domestic waste are produced daily around Kojeli, and these waste collected by the municipalities of districts are disposed at the Solaklar and Dilovası regular landfilling sites of Izaydash. Domestic waste are covered with covered soil. Also, odor barrier system is operated in order to prevent odor. Five tons of medical waste which are collected from about 500 healthcare points within the border of Kojeli province are disposed by Izaidash. Pathological and hazardous waste from healthcare facilities are disposed by being burned and other waste are sterilized with steam at 160 degrees Celsius and at average 5 bar pressure for 45 minutes and then disposed. Kojeli has four ports and about 12,000 vessels per year take into the ports of Kojeli. Izaidash also carries out the service of collecting the waste of vessels in the Gulf of Izmit. Licensed waste receiving boats work with this scope. Collect bilge, slush, west oil, polluted water, west oil and domestic waste from vessels in the Gulf. After collecting waste including petroleum derivatives waste, they are being separated from the water inside and the electricity is generated by sending them to this incineration plant. The project, which was started in the frame of including Kojeli Metropolitan Municipality, Tobitak, MAM, 
and four universities as research establishments in 2007. Biogas and energy generation plant was founded in the field of Izaytash. In this plant, biogas is obtained by the waste of grass, tribe and using the fertilizer of chicken and cattle. And this gas is transformed into electricity power. The plant also produces solid and liquid fertilizer, which is very suitable for agriculture. Zaydash is now an establishment which generates power with being the leader establishment of waste management. Zaydash, which sells electricity to national network more than it needs and generates electricity from hazardous waste incineration and biogas plants, also from domestic waste as well. Landfill gas has from solar regular landfilling sites are transported to the plant with collecting pipes and transformed to energy through gas motors. Two wind turbines were established at Izmit Tolaklar and Gebze Gaziler Mountain to take the attention to renewable energy resources and they are the systems to generate electricity of Izaida symbolically. Upon completing our hydroelectric power plant project, which is under construction, the company will generate electricity from a different source. One of the most important factors that makes Izaidash gain reliability in the sector today is having one of the most leading laboratories in Turkey. Izaidash Environment Laboratory, which enlarged its service inclusion with investments, was accredited by Turkish Accreditation Agency and obtained Environment Measurement and Analysis Qualification Certificate by the Ministry for Environment and Urban Planning. Environment Laboratory meets all demands rapidly with both its experienced personnel and technical equipment. The vehicle of sample receiving arranged with the scope is always ready on call for 24 hours. Our company performs all legal liabilities regarding its operations and quality standards of ISO 9001, ISO 4001, OSS 8001 and ISO 7025. OSS 1001. Also, it is given great importance to perform all the requirements on time and fully regard occupational health and safety. Izaidash is a member of European Union for Responsible Incineration and Treatment of Special West, Turkish Quality Society, Turkish Cogeneration and Clean Energy Technology Society, All West and Environment Management Society, Kojeli Chamber of Industry, Kojeli Chamber of Trade, Chamber of Marine Trade. As a leading role of waste management, Izaidash has put an important education program into practice. Our experienced personnel share their theoretical and practical information with waste producers through Izaidash Academy and contributes to develop a common environment language. With the same vision, Izaidash managers give lectures regarding waste management in University of Kojini. Zaijan is a social responsibility project in order to contribute to raise West and environmental awareness of our children who are at primary school. Four stories and a coloring book have been formed concerning this lovely cartoon character. The books that have been published in the set primarily distribute to elementary schools around Kujir. Zaidash which realizes not only social and sector responsibility missions, but also has foreseen the conditions of competition increasing gradually in the sector. 
Firstly, price and acceptance conditions have been improved. Visiting customers regularly and customer satisfaction have been taken as a basis. The West that was accepted to the plan with great efforts of employees and electricity generated by incinerator waste have risen to the highest figures so far. Isaidash, which performs a great development by the direction of the mayor of Kojili Metropolitan Municipality, Mr. Ibrahim Karosmanoglu, and breaks its records, continues to work with the same excitement and determination. Isaidash, operating with the conception of continuous improvement and being the friend of industry, carry on renewing itself and producing new projects. Zaydaş Turkey's first hazardous waste incineration plant. Turkey's first integrated waste disposal establishment. Turkey's most experienced sector employees. The most reliable establishment of the sector. Private sector dynamism with public enterprise liability. We are aware how important our qualities for you and us. These qualities mean trust for you and much more responsibility for us. Also, managing hazardous waste accurately and trying to be much more precise, faster and safer for the protection of our environment. Zaydash, since 1996, has provided perfect and reliable service to its customers. And the key to success is kept in its teamwork. Zaydash employees who are experienced in all process of waste management, evaluating the demands rapidly and having no concessions in any way in terms of law and regulations, are racing against time every day. Communication with customers, transportation, acceptance, analysis, and disposal operations of waste. All of them compose the indispensable parts of a giant plan that works continuously in regard to 24 hours non-stop. The vehicle fleet of Zaydash, which is always on move, and can never be monitored as a whole, takes a great deal of attention. Zaydash has a capacity of carrying about 300 tons with 19 hazardous waste transportation vehicles. The vehicles are on average 4 years old. Experienced drivers of Zaydash drive all around Turkey from Edirne to Erzurum, Mula, Trabzon, Konya, Bitlis and Hatay. 
by these special vehicles that don't carry anything except hazardous waste. They realize on average 2,000 routes per year and cover the route of 400,000 kilometers. In other words, they travel just 10 times around the world. How could this great organization start and operate? All system in Zaydash starts with an email. The mail that West producer sends firstly is received by the unit of customer services. The unit of customer services demands sample from the West requiring analysis, then sends price offer to the firm. Following up the approval process, West producer routes its West by vehicles that supply or the vehicles of Zaydash. As transportation vehicles are entering Izaidash, relevant procedures are applied one by one. Firstly, the documents of drivers and the vehicles are controlled. Then, radiation control is applied. After the West being weighed on the scales, the sample is received from it. After received sample is analyzed at the laboratory and the West is approved, the vehicle is leaded to the either incineration plant or regular landfilling sites. After transportation forms are signed and relevant copies are given to the transporter, forms are logged in. How could the West be burned? Hazardous wastes are incinerated in a rotary kiln between temperature of 921 and 1157 degrees Celsius and on average for 95-120 minutes by considering their caloric values and polluting rates according to a menu. Forming waste gas after incineration are burned twice, passed through for different treatment systems and released to air from the flue with the lowest values of emission limits specified by regulations. Through regular storing process, the waste which need to be eliminated are disposed by storing in special lands that have leak-proof floors according to the regulations. Izaidash, which have a great sense in the management of facility and applying occupational health and safety rules much more seriously, displays the same sensitivity on the subject of customer satisfaction. The mails, facts or questions of the customers are replied daily, and even instant. Zaydash gives much more importance regarding acceptance of waste and the management of vehicles. The only goal is to provide the disposal of waste that customers send within the frame of law and provide their corporate reputation not being damaged. Sales and marketing unit employees who work in accordance with this vision make about 700 customers per year. And the West Acceptance Agreement is signed with 3,000 different firms. One of the most important factors that makes Izaidash gain reliability today in the sector is having one of the most leading laboratories in Turkey. Zaydash Laboratory, which was accredited by Turkish Accreditation Agency and obtained Environment Measurement and Analysis Qualification Certificate by the Ministry for Environment and Urban Planning, takes great attention regarding both its experienced personnel and technical equipment. Zaydash, which is expert in disposal of industrial waste and offers services to whole Turkey, also serves regarding clinical waste, waste caused by vessels, excavation waste in the boundaries of Kocheli province besides. Provides a great plus value of its city. Moreover, Izaidash is in the position of energy production center. It generates electricity from landfill gas formed by storing domestic waste regularly and incineration plant and biogas from vegetable and animal waste and the wind. It also sells much of its need to the national network. Upon completing of hydroelectric power plant project, which is under construction, the company will generate electricity from a different source. We, 
as the leader establishment of West Management, have been working with the leader firms of Turkey for years. for clean environment and healthy society. Izaydaş Once more again, the new innovation in Turkey by Malatya Metropolitan Municipality. The first and only facility of Turkey that generates electricity from unsanitary disposal. Effluvia, fire, and carbon emission had seriously been causing a threat for quality of life. The problem has increasingly continued so far as a consequence of population growth, rapid urbanization, and industrialization. We, Malatia Metropolitan Municipality, take justified pride of activating the first and only facility of Turkey that generates electricity from unsanitary disposal by rehabilitating 101 acres of landfill in order to produce a permanent solution for better life quality. The energy facility, which has been equipped with modern technologies, meets the requirement of illumination for approximately 10,000 houses with 2.2 MWs of electricity generation per hour daily. We put an end to environmental pollution, similar to air pollution, which occurs by 1,200,000 liters of fuel burnout. With our environmental projects as Malatia Metropolitan Municipality, we sorted the issue of waste storage out with the new landfill facility, which was located on 128.5 acres of land. We continue to work on energy production technology as Malatia Metropolitan Municipality. So we are planning to supply the illumination needs of 50,000 houses by increasing the electricity generation from waste gases to 8.5 MWs with energy production projects from gasification, LFG gas, and biogas tanks. We accommodate with energy for your future. Malatia Metropolitan Municipality.